Hello, hello. Welcome to Coffee Craft. I am your tired and frustrated host, Anon Jr. Uh, after running late from work, uh, technical difficulties, and a variety of other things. I now finally appear from the Coffee Craft server in front of what is probably uh, one of the uglier buildings I've built in a very long time. And I ain't going to worry about it. Uh, I, there we go. Uh, I finished the design that I was working on last week and it works. It's okay. It's fine. Um, I know the kinds of things that I'd probably do a little different to include measuring things out a little bit more. Um, given, given the number of open hoppers that that farm has that would cause many large headaches were I to start tearing it down and trying to rebuild, I'm going to leave it like it is. It's just going to be an industrial eyesore over in the corner. And uh, I'll, I'll focus my efforts on getting this thing working, which, um, yeah. I, I, oh, yeah, and I still got to figure out what I'm going to do about a door here. Because the problem is every time you push the button to turn the farm on or off, it would also trigger the door. Uh, and I could probably put it a second button there for the door, but that leads to people almost certainly accidentally uh, triggering the door. So what I might do is I might put a carpet or a slab right there and then a fence gate in the top. Uh, that way when the fence gate is closed, a zombie kiddo would not be able to go under the fence gate because the carpet would push them up to where it's just a little too tall and you as the player would still be able to go through i'm like 80 percent sure that would be that would be good enough uh, i might go chop down one of those logs sitting there not getting farmed right and uh and give that a shot give that a try I just realized i wonder if that's the one that's uh messing things up I don't know. All right. Yeah. Something, something's wrong with the timing. Something is very, very wrong with the timing. And since I only kind of, sort of understand how it works, um, it does make it a little bit... Oh, yeah. I also put a uh, platform up here so it's easier to get TNT into the system. You know, for when we do get it working. Um, yeah, I, I only sort of understand how it works. And the broad strokes... Um, it's, it's figuring out the rest. Like, I know these are counters to count how many logs have gone past, so it knows whether it's pushing in, uh, you know, one or two or three or however many and, uh, something, something, lots of stuff. Or maybe I'll just find a simpler system and tear that down. I so don't want to do that, though. That was a lot of work that went into that. Um, oh, I also got the store the the storage area uh, partially enclosed. I kept with the same basic theme except for that one row of blackstone because uh, I needed to make sure that you could still open that top chest, which means I had to put stairs. And there's no basalt stairs. There's no polished basalt stairs. Uh, it didn't feel right to put stone stairs there. So I, I put in the blackstone to kind of tie in with the blackstone corners and then it looked really weird to have that one strip of blackstone and not anywhere else. So, I don't know. And again, th th this is probably the, the single ugliest thing I've built in, uh, in the season. Oh well. Good thing it's off in the corner in the back. Somewhere. Maybe, maybe I'll grow some extra tall spruce trees to hide it a little bit more. Yeah, rip out this oak forest and put in spruce. Nice, big, tall, thick spruce. Hide the building. <laughs> uh, 
So yeah. But that is enclosed. I no longer have to have uh, b or, well, I have to have lag attacks, but uh, I don't have to worry about panicking that the uh, that a lightning strike is going to hit some of the redstone down here and cause problems. Because if a lightning bolt were to hit that observer there, it could cause a problem. If it were to hit that observer down there, it could cause a problem. Uh, there's some, there's like one or two other spots in there that that could be an issue. Uh, it also means that you can stay in there and work the farm when it's working and, and not have to worry about getting assaulted by anything to include phantoms, um, which is nice. And once I get the gate or the door or whatever I'm doing over there sorted out, uh, it means you'll be able to do that. Oh, I almost forgot. Okay, I'm still in the green. I just realized that I got a lot of stuff that's, uh, damaged. Hi, Arcadius. You're here, right? No. You're just me. Coffee should be ready soon, too, so I, I will... I will hit to a very, uh... Very early intermission here in just a minute. Um... Yeah. Because coffee. Coffee is about to be a very necessary thing. And, uh... Because it was such a rough day at work today, I, I went and stopped by a special store so I could have some enhanced coffee, too. Let me take care of this door. Then I'll go park myself somewhere, uh, somewhere safe and enter a very brief intermission. And then we'll, uh, we'll go from there. I know... Rayest is held up at work, so she's not going to be on till later. Uh, I don't know where Medic is, now that I think about it. Yeah. You have to crouch to get in there. I really think a carpet would be enough to keep the, the kiddo zombies out, but I know, I don't think I know that's enough to keep the, the baby zombies out. So uh, I, I'd much rather take the, the sure thing than the aesthetic but unsure thing. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. All right. Let me go, uh, let me go caffeinate myself real quick. Stand by for intermission. If I can find the right button. There we go. Enjoy a pretty Jova. He's a good boy.
Okay. Achievement unlocked. Caffeinated. I should totally make that an achievement in the game. I don't know what I'd make you do to get it, though. Oh! There's an ex-medic frog. Oh, wow. Well. <sighs> so, where's everybody at? Uh, Ray Est is at work and is going to be late. Like, late, late. Arcadius uh, took an unintentional nap and is shaking the sleep off. Um, so he'll be here shortly. Oh. Short adjacently. He's also pouring some coffee. Yeah, I should, but I'm not. Should what? Coffee? Caffeinate? Oh, should always caffeinate. Yeah. I haven't been uh, sleeping very well the last few days, and I'm actually tired right now. Uh, that makes two of us, good sir. That makes two of us. And I'm afraid that if I go get some coffee right now... Oh, yeah. Um, I just realized we might want to put a uh, trap door over this. Because if you go AFK here, or you sit there, cycle through the night, although, how are you going to open that and... Oh, no, never mind. Never mind. I got this. Oh, I actually finished that thought in one minute. Oh, less than a minute. Alright, there's the oak stuff I need. A button. And... Oh. We don't have a whole lot of birch track doors. I mean... I thought about using a pressure plate, but uh... Then you run into the same problem. Here comes Arcadius. Yeah, I haven't seen him in a while. <laughs> uh-huh. Hmm. There we go. Because basically I want to make sure that if you're AFK, <laughs> if you were under there uh, through the night, you, you, you de definitely didn't want something wandering up and dropping down there, you know, like a creeper or something. So. Ah. It only hurt for a little bit. Yeah. Uh-huh. No. All right. So here's what I want to do. I want to build storage. What I'm thinking of doing is setting it up so that way instead of there instead of a storage system being down there, it actually pumps the items up into a storage system above ground. Um Because then you don't have to go down there if you need something that had accumulated there. Now, the other thing that would be nice, but is beyond my skill, is if there was a skull over the uh, entrance and exit. You know, like the building around the storage system and all that were a... Oh, okay. So you do that? Yeah, that is better. I have the hardest time with trying to get it to go into the hole. <laughs> so, uh. we'll do the... Hey, 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 I'm talking about... <laughs> look, look, look. Family friendly! Family yeah, friendly! Yeah, no, no. Did I say anything? No, you're the ones that went there. I I didn't until he started doing his... I, 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 I. It's not what I meant to say. 
But he's over here laughing like a little giggle bot. Kind of hard not to know where he went. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. <laughs> Anywho. Yeah, no, that's good. I like that. That works. How far am I going to need to... Alright. Wait, the farm is in that direction, isn't it? If I fall down facing this way... I am now facing forward. Ah, okay. So, if I wanted to run stuff from... There. Alright, so from the fall, one, two, three, four. Up we go, one, two, three, four. That's the wall. Gonna have to be here. Make sure I got the uh, hole in the right place. Eh. Nothing can possibly go wrong from digging straight down. Ooh, cool. A thicker her wrist. Getting there. is a ways down, isn't it? <laughs> yes, I know we have the iron farm, but the wandering idiot comes by asking for uh, iron ore trades for the mini blocks. I had intended to have a uh, update to the resource, the server resource pack done in time for today. But I came into contact with something at work that uh, set off a bit of an allergic reaction. And the, the Benadryl kind of put an end to... Oh, oh, hi guys. Hi, friend. All right. Uh, so the brick went there. That takes me there. So there's where I get to the barrel. Okay. Carefully. Right. Um, yeah. Okay. I might... Thinking, thinking. I put a hopper coming out here into. Ow! Hey! Do you guys mind? That's actually counterproductive. That's filling up the thing even more. Alright. <laughs> Oh! 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 Okay, I will not put it. Well, I will. Huh. I will have to very carefully put a soul sand there. Uh.
Well, that'll get your heart rate up more than the coffee. Do I have soul sand in there? No, I don't. I do have an ender chest. Do I have soul sand in my ender chest? I have soul sand in my ender chest. too much. I'm sitting here going boop when I put blocks down. Yes. That's what you're supposed to do. Sure. <laughs> blocks do not sit correctly unless you boop them. Mm-hmm. Alright. So I need I need ice. Lots of ice. I need a hopper, a dropper, a sticky piston, and two observers, rockets, somebody to sleep. Oh, no, 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 keep flying, keep flying, keep flying. Ah. Thank you. Alright, uh, let me grab the ice. A proper... No. Dispenser. I heard a ray of sleeve. Proper? Uh... Oh, what, leave, leave the Discord? Yeah. Oh. I think I want to put some sort of block so that way you know that there is a water tunnel there when you go digging. Something that's not going to be mistaken for... What do we have a bunch of? I mean, I could really flex and just use a bunch of iron blocks. Okay. I just want some things so that way if you're digging around in the area, you don't run into the, uh... You don't run into the shaft and accidentally start digging too far. And go, oh! Oh, there's something here. Huh. So if the items are going to come up here, where do we want storage to go? Can you tie it into the current storage water system? Uh, it's a little, I mean, ostensibly, yes. However, Comma, I'm not sure how far away you can transport items before they either despawn or disappear into the next chunk to, to forever live in stasis until you happen to walk by. Hmm. And, and yeah, so that that would be that would be the one, the big question, because I'd hate to set this up to run into. Yeah, you know, the main storage, and then go. Oh, <laughs> yeah. By the by, um, you, uh, you you just lost all your stuff because it traveled just outside of range. I really wish I could remember that number off the top of my head, but as we can tell by the stream, there's nothing off the top of my head. I wasn't going to go with the ball joke, but... Nah, I, I, I knew it was coming, so I figured I'd just go ahead and jump ahead of it. Hmm. 
Did you hear that uh, Amazon's going to try to buy MGM Studios? No. Yeah. I mean, it's not the worst idea. You, you, they got they got options for what they could do with it. it. I mean, Amazon does make decent movies. Amazon makes a lot of their own stuff, but you know what MGM has? An actual studio on the lot in Hollywood. And... That's that's nothing to sneeze at. Plus, you know, then you're buying the staff that actually has a little bit better know-how for how to how to not just how to sell stuff, but uh, how how to market videos to executives and get other studios on board and figure out who to talk to. Not like MGM's doing all that good at the moment anyway. Plus it gives Amazon the Stargate franchise, the Bond franchise, uh, and I forget what other intellectual property comes along comes along with it. I know that there's a few, I just don't remember what. I was kind of surprised that the James Bond stuff was mostly MGM. There, there's... Uh, one or two wrinkles that may or may not be a part of it, but it is by and large an MGM product. Well, to me, it doesn't really matter. I don't really watch many movies anymore. No. Not not interested, not interesting, you're just not not in, not feeling up to movies well, and such. Uh yes. <laughs> okay. I mean, look, yeah, I, I, I mean, I've all, looked at a lot of the movies coming out and there's not a whole lot out there that excites me. Uh they're talking about they're there's a studio talking to Henry Cavill about being the lead for a Highlander reboot. Well, and that's kind of my point, is you can't have a... It's like you don't have movies anymore that have original titles. It's all, you know, whatever yeah. the title is, rebooted. Right. Reboot, reboot, reboot. Oh, reboot. hey. Nobody has any original ideas anymore. You, 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 you're feeling all the nostalgia about such and such, right? Right? Yeah, I'm I'm waiting for the uh, the Elon Musk ran short circuit reboot. Oh, don't don't uh, mm -mm. You just put that in the universe. My childhood can't take that. Well, you know, I mean, that's the kind of stuff that happens now. Uh, no, I I know. Like, no. I know. Let good movies die. Just it, just just let let them let them age gracefully. What what is this age gracefully of which you speak? Oh, talk on it. I forgot a comparator. You know, it's when the gray slowly starts coming in, and you accept it. And um, hey now, <laughs> your your turn's coming. <laughs> up here, man. Always live dangerously. I don't always live dangerously, but when I do, when I do it, it's after a really long day at work. Uh, there's been a lot of that going around today. Every. Every instrument today had some really special problems. Very special. Very, very special. Did I mention special? Because it was a special kind of special. Yeah, I'm right there with you. 
uh, and, and a couple of some instruments were sent in for uh, for quotes. Uh, one of them very cutely just said that they needed a uh, they needed a new bridge and tailpiece while the back of the bass is flapping off and the bass bar is sagging and uh, the headstock oh. is also all cattywampus because it's coming unglued. But all, all they need is a new bridge and uh, tailpiece. Yeah. 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 So there, there was some of that kind of stuff. Uh, <laughs> there, there, there was one that, like, well, I know that one's going to be expensive because he picks up the base case and the whole, the whole head, like where, where the neck and the headstock are, just kind of flops over off to the side. You mean the scroll? Yes, the scroll. Sorry. <laughs> You're such a guitar player. Oh, hush. <laughs> <sighs> so is this Catan board lit enough that if I'm here and night is falling, it's going to be okay or no? Uh, the, no. <laughs> to the left bottom corner or on the floating platform mm -hmm. is a bed. Okay, should we maybe light words, this no. thing? No. Don't you dare. <laughs> Why? The way it looks. But we could use carpet. I could also go over the entire thing with string. That doesn't mean I want to. No, we got string. We do. I'm not going to suggest that, though, because I know what that entails. You don't know how many blocks I put down, so yeah. Uh, no, hey, yeah, I have a pretty good idea of what went into that. I'd be easy. We just go underneath and we pop out the ones that we need to and put, uh, whatchamacallit, the... It's already carpet, right? Hmm. I can't no, dig you, any you don't go under for anything. What, what do you... I wonder if they're now. I see you. I'm just I'm like, why? Why are you? Because then you can just pop out the stone blocks and replace them for ah. the lady blocks. Bloody oath. One day, I, one glorious day, I will actually start something and remember everything I need. Today. Today is not that day. Just happy all the sheep are still alive. Uh, that too. Um, <laughs> next season, let's not build the sheep farm on a plane where lightning storms exist. I don't think that. I don't think the lightning storms can mess with them while they're under. I wouldn't a like that. I no. wouldn't have thought so either, but here we are. They're in enclosed glass. There, no one was shooting them with a flaming bow. And when we found a missing one, there was always cooked mutton. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it's not like we could blame yeah. it on... <laughs> the um, odds of it always being a flaming weapon that killed them outside of lightning is a little... Also, it wouldn't mess up the aesthetic if you used a uh, glowstone for the border blocks. Yeah, but that's still not going to light the middle. It's going to go there. No, but that'll get you close, and you can use lanterns and campfires for the rest. I'm, I'm thinking that the answer she's looking for is yes, ma'am. Well, I'm looking for the ma'am. <laughs> land on the platform by the Catan board. Oh. But that involves flying skills I don't have. <laughs> Need 
one more hopper. Roll 2d6, see what you, uh... More hopper. Uh, I How do I roll the dice? The left stone button. So are we actually going to go play? Uh, how do you know what I got? Get up. I got a three. It's Again? I got a three and a six. Got not. Where do I put them? Back inside that. Nine is the forest up in the uh, top right, and the wheat in the middle left. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just Oh yeah, she rolled a nine. What do I get? Well, I'm not going first. I got a seven. <laughs> For serious though, if we're gonna play this, it might need to be lit. Oh, it's seven nineteen. I don't remember how the original, how long the original game takes. Like 45 minutes. But that's also when you're like versed at it. If it's like a first go through, it takes longer. Yeah. And if you're us, it takes longer. Um. In other words, if you're y'all <laughs> and I'm me going through it for the first time, then that means it's going to take three or four sessions. I mean, yeah. You're not wrong. <laughs> so we can do like an all day Sunday, Sunday special Sunday Sunday special coffee <laughs> crash co coffee co crash coffee crash coffee craft uh, <laughs> extravagant. <laughs> I mean, coffee crash is that our like after show? I mean, <laughs> yeah. I've had a coffee crash. What? They're no fun. What? What happens when the crew from Coffee Craft is finally done? <laughs> Join them for Coffee Crash. Gonna go there. An NSFW show because yeah, the go uh, there. filters are broken by that point. That is. Where you get to find out why they really call him Medic. <laughs> Reyes learns redstone. I'm really oh, worried. We already that. said we can't do that one here. in public. Yeah, no, we, we can't do that one. Uh... I say we're good dudes. Yeah, that's that's why we're talking about coffee crash. <laughs> you say wordy dirties. Yeah, it bad. Uh, I spotted a flaw with my plan. No! Where are the rest of my dudes? Stop filling my inventory. I'm running low on dudes, on. Huh? My dudes. They keep me alive. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what? Are you oh, are you watching me struggle with this as it empties the oh, entire I, inventory? <laughs> I'm over here making concrete and I wasn't paying attention. I'm watching you struggle oh. on the stream. <laughs> and the next thing I know, I hear what sounds like dirt. I turn around, and look, and I'm done busting out the the. the... <laughs> oh, oops. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I busted out all the obsidian. And, oh. oh. Uh, no. There we go. That was it. I got it. 
Although I've got a piece of obsidian here that I don't know where. Oh, there you go. This goes right there. Oh, uh, oh my, my. Yeah, I was trying to figure out, or I was watching you. Struggle. And they say, no, I. <laughs> they say, no, I hear dirt. I'm like, where's that dirt sound coming from? Uh, that's never a good. And anytime you start your sentence with where's, you, you know something bad's what? about to happen. That noise. Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah, we need to fix that. There we go. All fixed. Had a few moments like that, uh, working on the on the shelf for the building too. Are you sure you're gonna help me light it up? Hmm. <laughs> We're gonna back guy proof the Catan board. Ah, nice. Bring on you. Hmm? Bring on you. String? Yeah. You can't do oh. the lights. Why? Because you would mess up the aesthetic by trying to pull it off with lights. There's not enough block palette to cover up what you would need to do. Speaking of covering up, in about 30 seconds, could somebody sleep? Because I am on a big, wide hole. Mark's going to do it. I really don't know that string is the way to go with this. It is. There's not a whole lot of options. Not not if you want to maintain what he's trying to maintain. Green is about the only way. Uh, I don't know if you saw, but in the latest snapshot, there there's one mm -hmm. of those uh, there there's one of those items that you cheer until you find out more details. Um, the the cheering part is that there is a light source entity. It is an invisible entity that emits light that is only okay. available in creative mode. Okay. And we're sad about this? Uh, I'm because happy about the air, the ability to add light without having to put a block of some sort in there. I'm sad that there's no way to do that outside of creative mode. Oh. Yeah. That's silly. Mm-hmm. But, I mean, candles will be in there, too, so there, there is at least that, and that adds some more options, too, because uh, there, there are candles in all the colors, which helps. That'd be nice for game pieces. Uh, that'd be nice for a lot of things. I need to be able to put light upside down, though. So when's that going to be? And they there? stack up to four just like sea pickles, right? Yeah, they do. To give and you a variable amount colors? of light. And they come in all eight colors? Uh, yeah. Yep, they come in all eight colors. You can oh. light them up or put them out. Oh, you can make the game of life now because you can put the four pegs in the car. Oh. <laughs> Seriously? Oh, hey. hey, I like that game. Uh, I have enough life right now. I have enough life in my life. It's the only game I was ever successful with. Mm. <laughs> All right. I could make jokes, but I am practicing restraint right now. 
You've been listening to Jenny Lawson too, haven't you? What? Well, no, just the tone. That 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 was a very Jenny Lawson esque tone right there. You're so judgy. Uh, that too is another <laughs> another bit. <of> Jenny. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to try to go three for three? We can go three for three. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. I, I, I'm i not hating, because I, I, that's what I did while I was doing some shopping, so... I, I just can't listen to her books at work. I, I, I focus a little too much on the book and a little too little on the work, and so, you know production quotas probably should have gotten the uh, turtle helmet what's gonna run out faster the bottom oh no there we go sweet yeah it totally came in handy today too because one of my colleagues is homesick and oh had a very very intense introvert moment you did or and they did? They did. Okay. I mean, it, it's totally plausible that you would think it was me, but in <laughs> this case, it was not. Um, <clears throat> and uh, I got to send her the quote. I was like, at, at this time, I am reminded of a quote. <laughs> and uh, sent her the one that uh, only, only monsters call when they could text. Oh. Yes. And had her like dying laughing because truth. Add almost two full stacks of string. Oh. I didn't even get a half of a hex done. How do I want to run the storage? I really want to run it that way, but. Uh, Where okay. did you start? Okay, no, 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 no. I got this. Uh, oh. Clay closest to the uh, staging area. How do I see where the string? Oh, there it is. I do have brown and white wool over here, so you can make string. Oh, I've got string. You got string, rings and things. I have been, and I have been thoroughly enjoying. I mean, it is thoroughly enjoyable. So please don't hear what I'm not saying. Actually. And I also feel like if anyone, she would totally appreciate the fact that many times I've thought about writing her about the fact that, <laughs> you know, yeah, we may or may not have similar language expressions. And uh, every time I think about doing it, I change my mind. Yeah, she'll probably appreciate that part, too. As introverts of the world unite. But not too close. I mean, not like actually in person, but. <laughs> we can talk about it and pretend we're going to and then cancel on each other. Hey, that sounds like some of my old D&D &D sessions. Maybe they were just introverts then. <clears throat> okay, beautiful. Who, like me, struggled to communicate with people to tell them, especially when my job was peopling for a living, that sometimes at the end of the day, I had cashed in all my peopling points and I could not. Th <laughs> there, there was no more peopling, peopling to be done. That I liked. 
what in the world was that? <laughs> that okay, I was wondering if I was the only one who heard that and thought what? I was insane for a little bit. Heard what? Uh, you were at like 15 billion percent speed. Hmm? It sounded like you had a whole sentence and then the <laughs> and then the internet decided that it was going to compress it into a two second thing. <laughs> oh. Okay. So it's gonna be that kind of day today. Yeah. Yeah, it was. Uh, have I mentioned how amused I am at the uh, particular package store in our area? That there, there, there's, there's a a Jack Daniels shelf. There's a Canada shelf, but the Irish whiskey is kind of mixed in with either the, oh, sorry, no. Whiskey is either in the Canada section, the Jack Daniels section, or the Scotch. The Irish whiskey is tucked in a corner somewhere like a dirty secret. Are you really not expecting us to respond to this conversation? Because I feel like this is a setup to avoid policies. No, no. It's just one of those things where, where again, it's... I don't know. I, I was expecting more. I got all the jokes right now. More. I mean, while I will not on the internet say where we live, I will say uh, yeah, we that. don't uh, live in a primary city anymore. So that that you know. that was I, I was definitely going to continue with a rather oblique references. Like certain things are more populated in cities, and certain preferences are more common in places that are less cityish and more cow friendly. Bones and everything else. Yeah. Then we go. We'll go find a spot just to take a nap. Because we now live in a place where my random obscured interest in cow hoof trimming that I developed over the pandemic <laughs> could actually be used. Yeah. Nothing like trimming some cow hooves. That's what the cow I thinks. mean, the dude that I watch is, like, hilariously, like, Scottish. So, I mean, he's just fun to listen to, A. Well, I, I was getting ready to say, uh, you <laughs> in particular thoroughly enjoy that that, that particular uh, uh, lilt. What that? Accent style. Uh, mm -hmm. It does remind me of some of the international coaches, soccer coaches from back in the day. Yeah. Yeah. Like, heavily reminds me of some of them. And some of them are wonderfully hilarious people. Mm hmm. storage for this do we need? How much storage for this do I feel like building? All of it.
should have built Speaking this. Speaking of the Hoochie now does classes that you can sign up for online. Oh, for uh, Gaelic? No, for hoof trimming. Oh, for hoof trimming. I'll hoof to think about it. Really? That was necessary. Yeah, it was kind of necessary. Yeah. Uh, I'm glad he's getting it out of the system. <laughs> I'm very hopeful of you. But before Saturday? Yes. <laughs> How very hoofful of you? Oh, no. Not you too. It's like a disease. Yeah, I'm starting to get a little huff ended. <laughs> Hate you all. <laughs> Adorably, so I sent a picture of the cross stitch and then I felt the need to let my colleagues know because it's group text, it was not like work stuff. But yeah. I was like, hey, by the way, if you go to the cross stitch website, it, it's NSFW, so just beware. Yeah. Especially because one of the ladies I work with is a pastor's wife. So, um, one of my colleagues had to pull me aside and ask me what NSFW was, and it was adorable. Wait, what? Yeah. I, really? Yep. Oh. Huh. I need wool. Really? die or something if they can't get to the grass because of the string? No, they just won't regrow their wool. So if you shear them, you end up with a naked sheep for an entire season. Well, I don't remember shearing sheep being part of the game, so... I mean... It could be. No. <laughs> We're not actually harvesting the wool for trading. Or the lumber or I the stone. Know. Although, you could put a stone generator together. No, and... no, no, no. No Captain huh? Extra. What? What? No Captain Extra. What? I mean... Oh, no, they totally ate through it. Yeah. You just I didn't know they could they eat the grass through the street. No, you said what would happen if they can't eat the grass. That's not the same thing. Yes, if they can't eat the grass because of the string. Besides, if you tried to build generators and, and we harvested all the materials, we would quickly realize that the game has no finite reason it's supposed to have. I thought we weren't allowed to build those generators because I thought they were cheaty. Well, it depends no, on which ones you use. I also need to... Aren't you usually Captain Lawful about that subject? I am. There are stone uh -huh. generators that you can build that you don't run into that problem. And the sheep naturally, you know, will produce more wool. Hello, Beach Duck. Hey, Beach Duck. Hey, Beach Duck. And it's been just long enough for her internet to cut out, so bye, Beach Duck. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, look, I, I want to be mad. I really do. But, uh... 
Oh, there's a second hello, so that must have meant that her internet cut out while you're joking about her internet cutting out. <laughs> That's perfect. Okay, someone tell the sheepies to back out my space. Uh, why do I feel like I did this wrong? We're about to end up with less sheepies. They say, if you can't take it, get out of the pen. There should be one there. Those go there. Twice now? Twice it cut out, or? Or twice the hello. Or is this like one of the those Hobbit-style hellos? I said hello. You Hobbits do mean. Oh, wait, no, that's in the books where, you know, <laughs> that was the good goodbye. dialogue happened. And that was which? Or did I did I misremember? Besides, it wasn't hello, it was good day. Oh, that's right, it was good day. You did misremember it, because it's when he's leaving and it was good day. Is Yeah. Well, good day, sir. I said good day, sir. No, now you're thinking of... Uh, 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 Early the chocolate factory. Yes. <laughs> no, that's literally... Like, I will go grab the book and recite it to you if you would like. Good day, sir. I said good day. Um, By the by... They're they're getting ready to cast an actor as young. Uh, nope, 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 nope. I, Why do you look, people continue look, to try to ruin my childhood? You, you could say no, <laughs> but that doesn't change. <laughs> that 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 doesn't change that they're doing it. Sad to say. Is that what started the conversation about why we can't have original thought? No, no, that one was uh, a studio being in talk with uh, Henry Cavill to be the Highlander in the Highlander reboot. Which is just unnecessary. Uh, well, let's, like, Henry Cavill does some great stuff. He is the perfect actor for certain things. The Highlander is not it is not one of my top picks for oh, you know who we need to cast? Henry Cavill. Like like I I, I ex like maybe if you wanted to do a Conan hey, reboot. Chisel Jaw Swing Sword, right? Yeah. Check. Uh well, no, no. Uh somebody who actually has finesse. Like, I mean, we're, we're maybe half half a step short of casting Schwarzenegger as the Highlander. Again? I mean... Chisel jaw swings short. Check. Well, Schwarzenegger is great for Conan, except for the part that he had to lose muscle mass because he couldn't two-hand grip the sword. His bodybuilding had him so built. Again, I reiterate, he couldn't, like, he couldn't all clap. production is going. <laughs> Need big man swing sword. Must have good face. Ote. <laughs> I mean... Like, that is the level of grace and elegance we're tasking with. Maybe they just want some brand name with it. Well, I mean, that that I would buy. That has less to do with anything other than we need a big name. And you know who sells stuff right now? Cavill. Sell stuff and can swing a sword. I, can he swing a sword, though? I mean, what, what are some of his big roles? Yeah. Uh, Witcher? Uh, okay. Okay, no. Nope. You got me on that one. I forgot about The Witcher. <laughs> I, was, I was waiting for the reaction for that answer. I was like, yep, wait for it. It's no, coming. no. <laughs> Look, 
It's been a day. <laughs> it has been a day. Right, I'm, I'm waiting for the original Star Wars trilogy reboot where they cast Chris Evans as uh, Skywalker. No. <laughs> Uh, you know, in some other way. Uh, honestly, you know what? Yeah, but in the reboot, is he still gonna kiss his sister? <laughs> well, I'm sure that they'll they'll figure something out. Or are they gonna like retcon that? But, yeah, because that's not yeah politically correct. I don't oh, think it was. I don't think it ever was before either. either. <laughs> although, although I, think I, I it really think it was just another case of you know, Lu uh, I don't think Lucas really had a trilogy planned at any point in time until after there was gobs of money coming in. Like all of a sudden, I was like, "Oh, hey, there's money in good sci-fi, huh?" I have not a single, but a trilogy. Yep, totally had that trilogy. Uh, that's that's always been that's always been my suspicion. Okay, that's working. Those last ones are going to be junk. Now I just need to finish. Put's going to go there. Medic, what were you saying? Uh, About the kissing cousins, sisters? Is it? Does that make it better? Oh no, no! Oh. I was I was saying that in today, you know, with everything that's been going on in today's day and age, though, they may say it's acceptable now. No, don't. no, please don't put that in the universe. We're, we're, we're not even we're not even joking about that. You. Well, that has. Uh, no. <laughs> Ew. No, I'm good. I'm good. Space I don't know. Mm -hmm. Alaris today when uh <laughs> when I got really okay, upset. Replay? Alaris. Ah. Yeah, Why did you get upset? Arcadius really, really want to talk about it. No, I'm not. Oh. <laughs> Are you ready to talk about it? No, I'm not. Not not on Coffee Craft. Maybe on Coffee Crash, but not on Coffee Craft. <laughs> <laughs> uh, dude, I saw your face. I didn't even need to have voice on. I, I, I knew. I knew. How'd you see his Some face? Some words were being said. <laughs> Word, video, words okay. were happening there. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Ar Arcadius had him uh, on, on, on the screen, and yeah. There was an expression. There were hand gestures. That was there gesticulation. <laughs> there, there, there was a lot of things that are there left unsaid on this family-friendly channel. <laughs> um, can a bad guy appear on a block that has a baby block? I don't think so. It cannot. It's a block. But Arcadius was thoroughly amused. Well, he's always thoroughly amused. He is secretly chaotic. Secretly? I don't know that I like your guys' tone. Well, you're not the DM this campaign, so. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> Can 
they spawn on railroad tracks? Uh, no, no. Okay. Railroad tracks, leave. None of that. You gotta worry about. You do have to worry about hay bales. Did you say leaves or leaves? Leaves. Leaves aren't spawnable. Ah, okay. Hay bales are. Yeah. That seems a strange well, and painfully specific. Because it's one of the few blocks you're going to run into out here. I figure that should clarify. Just saying, that seems like a strange, like... Yeah, one, once, twice, three times a charm. Dev decision. Uh, it has a lot to do with what is a full block and what is not a full block. And some curious decisions around that. It's still a curious decision. All right, I leave it to somebody else to decorate, uh, but we now have storage. I'll add it to my decoration list. right hmm? you said I bother oh dear oh dear 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 also copyright uh well <laughs> that's what the mouse wants you to think does the mouse want that uh yes the mouse oh will... they do yep, yeah they do. yeah they do oh, that's so sad yeah, or were we not just talking about how much uh, of our childhood the mouse owns? Does that make Piglet a Disney princess? Ooh. Not a princess. But no, that but Disney, you know who is? is a Disney princess. Radar is. You mean Klinger? Yep. Not not Radar. That party foul. Yeah, 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 yeah. My bad. Sorry. <laughs> But yes, Klinger is. And I think he'd feel good knowing that. An original Disney princess. Alright, uh, where did that other... I feel like I shorted How much of this have we done? Oh, that's where the ice went. Um... Off the ice. What else am I running low on? Lots of stuff. I know I grabbed two pieces of soul soil. Oh, did I get? Did I get one out of there? Oh, the redstone is sparklier when you put string on it. Hmm. That's because you interacted with it. She's talking about redstone. Oh, 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 yeah. When you walk over the dust and it starts glowing. Yeah, that's because you not walked the, over not it. Not the dust, the ore. Oh, the... Yes, sorry. Um, speaking correctly <laughs> is not uh, not my forte today. Today. Today? Today. Just for that, I won't sleep. I mean, if you want to blow up the Catan board. Of course, it's not going to bother me. I'm nowhere near... Or outside, so. Bones. Okay, that is where the leather caps went. And I hate that when the uh, when you have the invisible item frames. It still won't let you click where the item frame is. You gotta click around the invisible item frame. I would mean you come back and unhide the item frame so you at least know where you're supposed to where where you can actually click at. We've done seven tiles so far. Out of 
Uh, I want to say a Catan board's like six. Done seven out of six, then we're excellent. Oh. Uh, what is it? Nineteen. There's nineteen tiles. Oh, that's <laughs> excellent. <laughs> you are working on the seventh one. Can they spawn on a spurgy thing in the desert? No. Wait, okay. are you talking about a dead bush? Because a dead bush does not block spawns. Oh, it doesn't. No. Oh boy. No, no more than tall grass does. Oh boy. Yeah, it counts as foliage. Look at it. But it won't move its string across it. Not while it's there. It no, it. yeah, you can't put it while it's there. If you put it on top of it, that should block the spawns because the game checks to see if a mob can spawn first. Then it randomly determines if it's going to be a baby uh, zombie or no, an adult if I try zombie. to put it on top of it, the thingy disappears. Oh. <laughs> I need more dead bushes. Yeah. It breaks it, so I would not put it on top of it. We'll see what happens. gonna happen is if it doesn't block spawns all the spawns are just gonna pop up in those spots <laughs> well we'll find <laughs> out and or we can test it somewhere go a couple blocks away lay down one block in the middle of the ocean with one of it and see what happens That sounds like science. Yay, science adjacent. Hey, science adjacent is clearly good enough. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Uh, guess, what I guess what I just found out. What? Beetroots makes red dye. Yeah. You didn't know that? Ooh, I didn't know that. Awesome. Wait, so I've been going to the stupid flower machine all the time. I because <laughs> we don't have a beetroot farm yet either. Well, we kind of kind Is that of do. something stuck in there. What I'm what I'm kind of working on right now. Why? No one wants beetroot. Yeah, Except you for do. die. For trading. Huh? Some of the some of the villagers that's you need beetroot to unlock the early trades. Oh. Yeah, I don't talk to those people that much. Yes you do. They're in the pumpkin and melon. Not at farm. the beginning. Oh, I just give them pumpkin and melon. I don't pay attention to anything yeah, else. I just But you gotta it. get them to where they'll trade pumpkin and melon. And for that, it's a random wheat, potato, carrot, uh, beetroot. And my point is I don't do that part, so I didn't know that either. Arcadius, I heard you talking IRL, but not over the mic. <laughs> I was saying that you're, you're missing the point, Anon. She's simply saying that she doesn't do that part. Like, real snooty, posh, British lady talking about how she doesn't talk to those people. I'm not offended by this description. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I let someone know today at work that uh, the next batch of uh, cold brew was made, but it was not concentrated because I was trying a couple of different brands to see which one I liked better. Ah. And um, we we totally had a fun. She's like, "Oh yeah, I'm I'm just getting used to this whole like fancy coffee thing." fancy coffee and i was like like she was trying to word it very nicely i was like oh dude we can call it i am totally okay with the fact that i am an absolute coffee snob it's cool 
Like, we don't have to play around that. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, the other thing I was thinking we probably ought to do is loot Medic and the audience in on some of the ideas we were kicking around for next season. Uh, <laughs> Want to go first? Huh? To go first. You gonna you want to go first? Yes. Okay. Go for it. Okay. You ready, medic? Yeah. <laughs> okay. You don't sound ready. Don't laugh at me. Stop that. Why do you sound like? No, that? I was laughing at the fact that I'm in the next season, but I've got to be lived <laughs> in with the audience on what's going yeah, on. Yeah, because you don't live on my couch to talk about things when I'm like in my PJs and I have an idea, which is what happened the other night. Yeah. <laughs> and I haven't spoken to you since because my work life. Anyway, uh, so the great idea that I had mm -hmm. is this. Is we have the problem that when we start a new season we can't really like do a lot with the regular world because they split the Dumafachi. um yeah i, uh, I kind of hate when they split the Dumafachis. <laughs> it's okay you can put the correct words in post anyway no, um, <laughs> it doesn't work that way <laughs> Yeah, our problem is because they're splitting the Caves and Cliff update into two separate updates. One of them coming summer, whenever that is, and the other coming holidays, whenever that is. Uh, there, there was a big question about how we wanted to run the updates in no small part because um, the the terrain generation isn't going to hit until the second update. So we're going to get copper, we're going to get a bunch of other stuff with the first update. We're going to get a ton of blocks, but we're not going to get the new mountains, we're not going to get the new caves until the second update. Which means... In which case, we would have to nuke everything and lose everything we built. Uh, mm -hmm. not, not just that. Um... You can't really nuke the overworld like you can the nether or the end. Unless you're an admin of greater skill than I possess. And since I'm the only admin we have at the moment, um, we're, we're, we're stuck with my limitations. You are the skill bar. Yeah, yeah. Y your server can only be this complicated. <laughs> so... We were bouncing around some ideas to, because the 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 idea of starting a season in the summer, and then ending at holidays and starting another one was unappealing. That's not enough time to really. That's not enough time. Uh, so we were trying to figure out ways to start a season with the summer update and still be able to take advantage of the new terrain generation afterwards. One of the ideas presented, and the one that I've been kind of warming up to the more I think about it, is uh, Coffee Craft Tiny Homes Edition. We, we set a ridiculously short world border. Like, three chunks by three chunks square. By the way, you don't want to know it took me like half an hour to get uh, to most, accurately explain uh, what I wasn't imagining there because I don't know the distances on anything. Most of our discussion was her saying nine by nine when she meant nine total, not nine by nine. And conflating understandings and misunderstandings because uh, of, you know, the difference between chunks and blocks. Because there was times where it's like, you know, nine blocks by nine, nine blocks by nine blocks, nine blocks by nine blocks. No. <laughs> yeah. So the idea is that we set the world border ridiculously small. So you're pretty much never leaving the spawn chunks. Like, it, it is the central spawn point. The, the central spawn chunk and the border of chunks around it. And then you get a chunk, I get a chunk, Arcadius gets a chunk, Reyes gets a chunk, and there's the community center chunk in the center. 
and uh you do what you can with your chunk you, you have from like the bottom to the top but yeah it's your tiny home chunk so you've got from bedrock to build height but you only got the one chunk to build in and that also means we need to get creative with obtaining various resources because if there's not a particular biome in there, then you're going to be short stuff. And so trying to find the various things that need finding. You can't I leave, think it would be fun. You can't leave those chunks to get stuff? No, because nope. then you're you're building out the terrain. And when you delete chunks and rebuild terrain, you get some really weird stuff happening uh, that, that somebody like Azumavoid could deal with. But I, I am not Azumavoid. So. Say what? <laughs> that was so. I'm not Azumavoid. Oh, oh. Did, did it cut out again? Yeah, it cut out, but then it caught up to itself and said all of your words in oh. like half a second. I I really wish and I could. And it sounded like I like really the Energizer I, Bunny. I really wish I knew what yeah. was going on. I, I'm curious how it went out in stream as well. It because Discord's being a little special. I, I I wonder if somebody's Steam client is downloading something or. Well, I just know. rebooted my computer. Hold on. I, I'm showing I'm showing good stream health. Hi guys, I just need a smidgen of XP. I haven't seen any blip in stream. Okay. But I will admit I can't hear you on stream because Discord and stream... Yeah, the yeah, time. then you get the weird delay and it's all the wrong kind of special. Yeah, right there. But uh, anyway... The other idea we were having oh. was... Well, that's one. Uh, I think Anon had one. Yeah, one was a variation one. of that where... Uh, we get a starting island. Like we find, we find where the spawn point, where the the world spawn is on an island, and so we're just castaways on a desert island until the update hits. And so whatever we have on that island is what we have on that island, and we build with that. So it's a variation on the same idea, but instead of having a hard world border, uh, you, you've got the the. The general, the general area, and I want to say there was one other yeah, idea that we tossed or, around. Well, you, you know, if you're going to go so far as to find a spawn or find a seed that has an island as a start point, then why don't we just find a seed that has a mushroom island as a start point? <laughs> That be our community center quote area, I, I, where the only well, thing Reyes has to has to worry about are the phantoms. phantoms, and then we wait until the thing drops, and we go from there. I wasn't going to do that hard a search for an island. Um, I mean. Honestly, we could just use the same seed as this one. It would end up with different terrain generation, and we did start off on an island. Although with My the different terrain, with... the different terrain generation would also mean that we wouldn't, uh, we might not actually start on an island. So, I, I, I'm, I'm trying to avoid too much seed hunting. Uh. Finding an island is infinitely easier than finding a mushroom island. If that makes sense. I think you, uh... I think you're forgetting that you have two people on the server that work from home and have lots of time during the day to find a mushroom island seed. Yeah. Here's, here's the other side of that, though. There's a lot of resources we won't be able to get a hold of on a Mushroom Island because you need mob farms to make that happen. Well, there's a lot of resources we're not going to be able to get a hold of on a regular island either when most of it's going to be sand <laughs> and you're lucky if you start off with a tree. 
Yeah, that's what the wandering trader's for. He'll come by with a sapling sooner or later. My concern with all of those is if we have a soft world border, once you start digging, unless we are like literally just like spending a day like pulling drill style, digging our world out in full, it's going to be easy to get lost and load other additional chunks. There's that. Yeah. Um, which is which is where Arcadius's um, idea comes in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we don't even bother with trying to set up a new world until the second update comes out. Instead, yeah. we have a short season of something like Skyblock, where the three of us all work together to try and get all the achievements in Skyblock. The four of us. How many did I say? You said three. Apparently, I don't count. It's cool. Uh, no, I think I think anyway. he was forgetting me. No, I don't. or he's anyway. forgetting himself. I, <laughs> there's that. I, I forget myself um, sometimes too, but. <laughs> well, can I throw out a suggestion? Okay. You totally can. Absolutely. You just were not on the couch when I was in my pajamas. Since uh, you know, Mister Admin has the capability of just spawn of just stuff in, then. Just spawning stuff in, mm -hmm. like in the beginning, okay. Uh, wherever we start at, uh, the starting area before we actually have our official start, where the three of us aren't even on there yet. At the starting area, you put up a uh, a uh, portal, and then we just do the 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 initial start is us going directly to the nether and we build the nether you can live in the nether now yeah i had that thought the problem is is that he can't nuke the overworld like he can the end or the nether like we did this yeah season. but i i think right, what medic is getting at is instead of nuking the overworld we're just in the overworld long enough to spawn and go to a portal if i'm understanding correct. correctly uh, okay right Right. Uh, in other words, uh, Anon starts the, the map, spawns in the obsidian and the flint, makes a portal right there at spawn. So when we spawn in for the first time, we immediately go into the portal. And there you go. And at what we can do <laughs> We can do everything in there um, that we can do in the out, out world except for anything that has to do with water. So we won't have the water transport. We won't have um, the water... Iron. Diamond. Well, we won't have any of that. We, we won't have hardly any of that at all if we wait a couple of months for an update to come out. We can't move outside of a set area. Uh, true. To to a certain extent, yes. Uh, we can get villagers without waiting for the update. We can get everything that villager trading offers without waiting for the update. It would That's be if we it would be the diamond side of a village. No, you, you set up a uh, set up a zombie spawner and just keep killing them until a zombie villager appears. Then you cure the village. You cure the villager. Well, in order, repeat, and then in uh, order to kill, in order to cure the villager, you gotta have a golden apple. Yeah. So that means what happens we, if we don't have the gold or the. I mean, you see what I'm saying? I, I understand what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, but but now now we're getting into it'll it'll be a little bit later because we'll have to be. What happened to my basalt? Okay, weird. Um, it would have. It would definitely. It would mean that the villagers would be a later game than we've done previously, because you would have to wait until you were at a point where uh, you could get to the Nether for the gold and that kind of stuff. So that's so we we wouldn't have villagers as early as we did this go round. That's for sure. Now the we can kind of do a, a combination of both, and just you know have a spawn island, 
you put the the portal on there, and then we spend most of our time in the Nether building out the Nether. Well, I mean, e even if, even if we did the island or the tiny chunk, we still have the portal, and we could still get to the Nether. No one's saying not go to the Nether, so that that would be that would be the expansion on resources for. Hmm? Let's not speak for everybody. One person on the server always says, "Don't go to the Nether." Yeah, you don't go to the Nether. We, we, we can totally make a little trap for the zombie pigmen to, to fall in. All we need is... To... I'm, I'm just saying, I die a lot. Mm -hmm. And you like this thing being family friendly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't have to go to the nether all the time. <laughs> you, you just have to... You just have to go... Arcadius. Could you get me some quartz? Please... No. Perk of marriage. Huh? It's the perk of marriage. <laughs> it came in the contract. These are all things that we should hash out. Maybe this weekend, while we're in between, you know, TPK and everything. <laughs> but you know, I, I, I believe it's coming. <laughs> I, 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 I did want to make sure that we also started talking a little bit about plans, uh, in public too, because somebody's been watching gotcha. the stream replays, and I'm sure they also have questions about what we're going to be doing for future, future endeavors. Pretty. Yeah, Sorry. I I think uh, I think it will be I think it's going to be a lot of fun one way or the other. Um, oh, we we will have fun. I come on now. We, we <laughs> yes, but will we have curse free fun? Because again, some of these uh, ideas I just want to remind you. Certain people bad. don't survive well. <laughs> all all the ideas still leave plenty of of overworld building. It just, okay, you know, just it's tiny house style. Our Arcadius will be much better suited for it because he tends to build the tiny houses anyway. He does. Or, or but I'm... That is my only concern with tiny homes is what happens when the spawny sad people do the spawny sad things. Hmm? But it, it tiny space, as we dig down... More bad people in concentrated surface area. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, that, that just means that when we get a mob farm, like, you know, in, instead of a creeper-only farm, I'd probably do a general mob farm because we would need more of, you know, the bones and the arrows and the other stuff that would come with that. Ooh, have question, have question. Okay. Um, But I need to be in person for this question, so hold on one second. Oh, no. Should I be Well, concerned? there's... I don't have all the words that I need. Oh. Hold <laughs> on. Where are you? Okay, there you are. Where's everyone else? Uh, oh, world not loading. World not loading. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Th there's been a fair amount of that happening today, too. Are you guys all in the overworld? Yes. Mm -hmm. Come to the parking lot behind the church. The parking lot behind the church? That's not a parking no. lot. That, that That's a mountain that just hasn't been filled in yet. It's a flat bit of concrete behind the church. It's a parking lot. That's not concrete. That's stone. Stone, gray surface, whatever. Okay, so it's a cheap parking lot, whatever. No, I, I just haven't finished filling in the, the grass to make it a mountain. Or okay. to, you know, so It's a really hillside. cheap parking lot. <laughs> okay, there's one. Where's the third? Are, are, are you on Fifth. your shulker box? Six. I mean, we have yes. podiums. <laughs> no, I have my shulker box. <laughs> hear ye, hear ye. On the shulker box. 
No, because I have a question and I don't have all the words and it's going to need all you guys to translate ra tra translate me. <laughs> there was somebody here a second ago. Yeah, they ran away. Medic, are you coming? Medic? Where'd he go? Why is he a black square? Why what? When I hit tab. I don't know, but you should eat something. I just noticed that you're down three hearts. No, I'm not. I have all my hearts. No, on the tab screen it shows you down three hearts. No, that's Arcadius. Thank you very much. Oh, okay. I, look, I, I just saw somebody down three hearts and assumed it was you. Because, let, let's be honest, nine times out of ten, it's you. Medic. Don't they ask the medic? Medic. Where'd he go? How do you find out where someone is on the server? Fly around in circles. Uh, where do you find out, or or where do I find out? Because as long as I don't dyslexic the command, I could totally just you know bring him over here. No, don't <laughs> do that. That's not nice. I know. I I try not to do stuff like that if I can at all help it. Flippy, flippy. Let's see, where is he? I don't see his name. Medic? He disappeared. Is he in the yeah. a AFK box? Probably. Or did he have a work work event that needed to... I was about to say, he, had a work he might event. be AFK a second. Okay, I'll try this with the two of you. I might need him though. Give it a minute. He'll be here. Eventually. Now I can go back to building his wall. Uh, I, I I was trying to figure out what I was going to do with the last little bit of stream time. Because I didn't really plan beyond the skeleton storage. Hmm. Um, actually, okay. no, no, no. You guys are going to be translating right. my I language. To I totally forgot that I had already... Uh, I finally thought of an idea to deal with uh, some of the villager farms under under there. Uh-oh. We lost an Arcadius. Yep. Go ahead. Try to explain. Okay. You got this. So, let's say this was a brand new world. A whole new world. A whole new world. And it's day one, stream one, blah, 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 blah. Mm-hmm. Okay? Okay. And we do the server thingy where you pop it up and then you say, okay, everybody, we're going to go in three and one, two, three, ping. Yep. And it makes that sound. And I come into the world. I've got to see if there's a resource here. pack that will let you <laughs> ping when you log into the world. There's got to be an event to tie that to. Okay. So I ping and mm -hmm. I, I go poof and I'm, I'm here. Huzzah. Everywhere you go, can there you, you really are. Go, can you really go poof and ping at the same time? I mean... You poof and then you ping. It's an order of events. And then you huzzah. Anyway. <laughs> also totally random, but Renfair is going to be on this year. Anyway. Wait. Um, wait, wait. How, how, did, how did you get from... Huzzah! Huzzah! Anyway. So... Okay. I haven't had enough coffee for that connection. I have poofed and pinged and huzzahed, and I'm standing here. Mm -hmm. If no one else was here, or everyone else was standing exactly where I am, yep. how much other chunky groups of blocks become a thing to be the world? Visual distance. Uh, render distance, which I believe is 16 chunks. I, I'd have to look at the actual server settings to validate that. So here's my question. Mm -hmm. Is there any point in us... So, like, if we did the 9 by 9 chunk thing, would it still load three outside by three of chunk, the world? 9 total. 
Mr. Bum is so hard. If, I mean, look, if, if you want to do nine chunks by nine chunks, that, that is no, an option, I don't. too. That's not a tiny, but, that's not, that's not a tiny home. No, 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 that's no, a we're, no we're not in tiny middle home. class. Anyway. So if I spawn here and we do, and this is a chunk and that's a chunk, boop, mm -hmm. and that's chunk, boop, and that's chunk, boop, and that's chunk, boop. And this is a chunk, boop, and this is a chunk, boop, and boop, Your chunks and are out of alignment. Boop, and those are... That's not my problem, that's the dev's problem. Anyway. <laughs> so we have our little chunks. If I'm standing on the corneriest corner of this chunk, mm -hmm. will... If we have the world border up, will that still load a bunch of more chunks? Yes. Oh. So it'll. Oh, seriously, dude. I thought I woke up. Look, the phantoms are going to come and start attacking Rayest, and I'm going to sit <laughs> back and turn on PvP while she deals with that. <laughs> okay. So. Even with the border up, the hard border mm -hmm. up. You're still gonna mm -hmm. have to render distance spawned in. Yeah. So sixteen chunks Which out is... from each corner. That's a lot of chunks. No, that's not a lot of chunks. That leaves plenty for exploration once the next update comes up. And it will integrate into the terrain better than trying to delete stuff and re regenerate it. So by doing a three chunk by three chunk, mm -hmm. is that only adding one more chunk to our 16 chunk that will load and making it whatever? I feel like we've entered a word problem. Whatever it is, we have. What I'm trying to figure Bobby out is has would it be better to. Three chunks. If the server <laughs> adds 16 chunks, how many chunks <laughs> does Bobby have? <laughs> Basically. Okay. You're not being helpful right I, now. I didn't oh. sign up to be helpful. You, did, did you did you not see? What I'm trying? Nothing nothing what? in the stream title said anything about being helpful. You are the admin. Admins are supposed to be helpful. No, no admins are not. Do you know how many horror stories there are about unhelpful admins? In the company that we've worked for alone? Shh, we're not talking about that. <laughs> anyway, so... It now it so my question is, do we... Yeah, because you invoked the name. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. It's like Beetlejuice, you don't say it. Anyway. Um, so, is there a benefit to... It's part Doing. of why I was leaning a little bit more towards the island. Because if we found a sufficiently remote island, then render distance goes out to... Render distance just goes out to ocean. So you're not going to get more of the landmass terrain until you actually fly out. And there's nothing that says that we can't try... If I can't find... There's nothing that says that if I find the right size island, I can't compute where the world border should be to give us a hard limit outside the island. We would want the hard limit to be closer so it doesn't continue to expand. Yes. So may maybe that's it. We, we, we let the, the two... The two with the penchant for just loading up random stuff to find a absolutely mind-bogglingly remote island and and then I I find the world border maybe five blocks out from the edge of the island maybe a little more than five blocks you know somebody's gonna want to fish off the side of the island mr. fidgets over yeah. there in particular
Come on. You, you... Or is that all the more reason to just consider doing the Skyblock idea? Uh, that that does have merit too, because I've never done Skyblock. I've seen people play it. I, I understand in theory how a lot of it works. Uh, but the only problem with Skyblock is I don't know what resources it takes to run it. Everything I've found in my initial searches mm -hmm. shows hosting options, as in people are running Skyblock servers. I haven't found much of what it takes to run our own Skyblock server. So, I mean, obviously we got plenty of time to find out more details. Uh, so maybe, maybe, maybe that's what... We, because, again, we can't have them look for islands till there's finished code to look through anyway. Because the terrain generation is going to continue changing through the snapshots anyway. Fair. Sorry, I, I had to get out of the rain. Head. My hair's getting wet. Cute. Do we seriously not have any lecterns in there? We seriously don't. Curiouser and curiouser. So, yeah. Uh, I, I guess that's kind of the next step then, is to figure out if we if Skyblock is even an option. Because if we can't run it on the current server, and we can't run it in any server we could hope to upgrade to... Um, then there's no point. In then there, there's no it. point in looking any further into it. And then we go back to either finding a remote island or just, you know, doing tiny chunks in the middle of the in the middle of the landmass or something, wherever we happen to be. Just I got lost. Hmm. I got lost in the water cooler. You got lost in the water cooler. Yeah. Where in the water cooler did you go? Uh, I tried to find Medic. Oh. And I thought he was on the inside somewhere and I can't find out anymore. Where are you at? Are you I in the know. storage? No. Um, no, I'm in the inside of the outside. The inside of the outside? <laughs> Where the redstone is. That, that that sounds like a novel, like where the wild redstone <laughs> is. <laughs> I don't know how I got here. Which redstone? Where's the door? Can someone go on the inside of the inside and maybe I can try to find you? I am. I'm looking for you. I don't see you. Oh, wait, a door! <gasps> I found it. <laughs> you found your way? Yeah. Did you also find a little cake that says eat me? And a little potion that says drink no, me? No, I was too busy freaking out because I didn't know what blocks I could touch to go anywhere. No, 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 beach duck. Not quite yet. Uh, yes, there, there's a lot of aimless wandering because uh, we're, we're probably going to be wrapping up soon. I, uh, I'm wandering aimlessly. I many, was getting lost. Ma many rough days at work were had. Boop. No. No, stand on the trap door. Now push the button. I don't like the drop. No, nope, he's not down here. Uh oh. Uh where's a I know what I need. Uh if you waterlog mm -hmm. nope, a, redstone. If, hmm? I'm Where's just lost. It's cool. Ooh, what's down here? I'll borrow one from there. If you uh waterlog a chest, you still don't take the fall damage and you don't have to try to swim out of the block you landed in. Ah. Oh, gasp. No, bad people, bad people. Oh, How did a wait. zombie get oh, in there? Who's that? Where did the zombie come from? He's fighting the skellies, though. That's kind of a good idea. Yeah, because no, well, they shot at him trying to shoot at me. 
But that doesn't answer the question of how a zombie got in there. There shouldn't be any way for a zombie to get in there. <laughs> Your voice just did the thingy again. What? I heard it for the first time right there. Uh, is it Discord? It's gotta be Discord. It's Discord? I don't know. Is that the same thing? Or, or, or maybe, maybe... Spectrum Cable is displeased with us. I don't know why. They raised the rates and I paid it. Again. Oh, like, they, they've actually raised raised the cost of high-speed internet to the point that I'm almost willing to possibly consider AT&T. Because at least Whoa. then there'd be fiber. And I mean, you were, like, staunchly team no AT&T originally. Uh, yes. Still. But if I'm going to pay fiber prices, I might as well get fibered rates. And obviously, Spectrum doesn't care any bit more than... Grumble, grumble, grumble. I will I stop that again. rant before I get... Uh... <laughs> I got lost again. How did you get lost again? Are you still looking for I'm medic? I'm in medic's place. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Somebody needs street signs or organization. Because it is very easy to get lost in there. Oh, it's snowing. <laughs> is this the down? I can't find a medic. And there are so many doors in this place. Oh, redstone, not my place. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you, you said that. That means that you're not over here in the bedrooms. You, oh, no. Dang, it's a statue. Hmm? Oh, is that you over I that way? I keep getting faked out Where's by that a statue. <laughs> oh, no, that's me! I'm on your screen! Yeah. Oh, hey, there you are. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm still laughing at. Oh, hey, that's me. Probably should have slept before we left. Yeah, maybe. Mm -hmm. Okay, he's on somewhere. Where is he? A has Jabba been fed? Nope. Nobody loves him. Has he really been fed? Not that I know of. I, I, I can hear Oh, oh maybe he was. Yes, he was. Oh, okay. I just saw him wandering aimlessly, and I wasn't sure if that was because he had been forgotten or he needs the business that happens after he's been fed. He Which is usually good. Afterwards. Yeah. Which means that I probably ought to wrap this thing up anyway. Yep. <gasps> what was that? I fell. Where? Where are you that you On fell? On the top of the water cooler. From the top of the water cooler? Yeah, it's okay. I had my cape on. <laughs> it just scared me for a minute because I forgot for a second. You're killing me, Smalls. Try. Find a safe place to hunker down. Wait, creepers! Creepers! Where? In the place! The place? Yes! Which the place? Behind the storage unit. The concrete maker, the sheep farm... Behind the storage the... unit. By the concrete maker. Oh, I thought you were talking about in somewhere. Yes, in our town. Yeah, and there's skeletons out here, too. This is not very friendly. I'm going inside. 
painting. Yeah, somebody did. Not me. Mm-hmm. Uh, the skeleton what? knocked down a painting. <gasps> You're so disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> Quick to blame that on the skeleton. Well, he did. Uh huh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Where would he AFK? Did he AFK in the sheep farm? That's what I've been trying to figure out this whole time. Well, now you got me wondering. No, no, no. I'm not gonna keep wandering aimlessly. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go close this out. I heard. Okay. <laughs> I heard creepers. Goodbye. And I was worried. Oop! I missed the ledge. Okay. Let me get into my safe place. This is where I save. No, oh, this is where I fill up my inventory so nobody dumps stuff in there. Uh, <clears throat> this is where I say thank you for joining along. We do this every Tuesday at 6 30 p.m. U.S. Eastern. Uh, normally with more, well, I'd say normally with more focus. We try for more focus. Next time there'll be more focus. Maybe. Mostly. Most likely. Uh, Thir- not Thursday. It hasn't been Thursday in a very long time. Fridays at 6.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern, I do Games Revisited, and Rayest and Arcadius are joining me for the playthrough of Trying 2 that we started last week. And it is good fun, especially if you love hearing... <gasps> no! Ah! Oops! No, 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 mm. <laughs> And various other noises of surprise and dismay. Um, and, and good-natured fun, and just a nice laid-back playthrough of Trying 2, where we try to find all the XP and show you all the game, and just have all sorts of fun. Uh, those episodes and these live stream replays also get uploaded to my YouTube channel, so um, subscribe there if you haven't already. That'll let you that'll let you get. Uh, notified when new content gets posted. I've got some other stuff that I promise should be coming soon adjacent, maybe. No, I'm not going to promise. I can't promise. I just know that I've got things that I want to do and eventually I will get them done. And if you subscribe, you'll know when that happens because you'll get the notification and it'll show up in your list. Alright, before I finish finish, let me go see if there's anybody around to raid. It looks like Grimly is one of the only guys that I'd normally give a raid to who is alive in there. So uh, I'm going to hit the title screen. I'm going to say thank you for joining along. Just stick around long enough to, to raid Grimly. He's a really good guy, uh, pro streamer, I and I highly recommend his channel. Do give him a follow if you haven't already. All right, here we go.